How's it going, guys? It is Spazdick Nerd. Welcome to the next part of God of War. And uh, today, we are at the mountain base, heading to the mountain. Uh, I'm sure the last episode was a little shorter than normal, which is fine by me. I like to keep them a little shorter from time to time. Um, and yeah, we're on our way to the mountain peak uh, to spread the uh, mom's ashes. Fae. Oh, is that Faye's ashes. smoke? It's like toxin or dark or something. Stay back, boy. Ugh. What is that? We must find another way up. The witch! Wish she was here. Bet she could get us past this. My magic is useless against the Black Breath, and there's no way around it. Oh. Odin saw to that long ago. What are you doing here? Making sure you can finish your journey. Why wait to warn us? I was busy saving my friend, if you remember. <laughs> the Black Breath is a corruption of magic even I can't dispel. Only the pure light of Alfheim is strong enough to break through. But that road is long. What does this goal mean to you? It's everything. Follow me. Why help us? Maybe I see more of myself in you than I'm willing to admit. Maybe. Maybe by helping you, I'll make up for a lifetime of mistakes. Yeah, you dumb bitch. <laughs> or maybe I just like you. Even though we shot your friend? Even though you shot my friend, yes. <laughs> Where must we go? To a realm beyond your own. Oh, so this is when we go all the way back to the Bifrost. Going uh -huh. to another realm? Are you coming with us? Only for a little while. Only for a little while. Um, so all that works. So technically, until you. I don't you get the light to spread the ashes. Yeah, you can't you can't do that yet. You gotta go all the way back. Okay. Wait, why is it why are we going so slow? Come on, man. I'm trying to get somewhere. We'll use this. Graythaw. Can't. Sindri said it was broken. Sindri? The dwarf at the foot of these hills. He was fixing it when we got here. Well, no one was there when I passed by. Perhaps he finished. Dwarves are awfully resourceful. And irritating, based on the two we have met. <laughs> that too. <laughs> oh, there we go. I was like, let me, let me break some pots, goddammit. Just give that a turn. There. So we're gonna end up right Tyr's there. temple is at the center of the lake. It is from there we travel to Alfheim. Thankfully, it's no longer underwater. Why is that creature in the bay? No one knows. He just appeared one day. Hmm. Soon after, Thor attacked, and their battle could be felt across all the realms. Ultimately, it ended in a stalemate, and Thor returned to Odin empty-handed. The serpent stayed and grew so large, he now spans all of Midgard. See? Told you. <laughs> They've hated the each other ever since. Destined to kill each other come Ragnarok. You believe in Ragnarok? I dearly wish I didn't, child. You know, we actually talked to the world serpent. You did? An exaggeration. I'm good with languages. Even ones I've never heard before. But when he talks, I can't understand any of it. Sadly, no one can. He speaks a dead tongue. Oh. Must be lonely. Wait, wait for me to open the door? <laughs> Bitch, please don't. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Yo, welcome. Watch your step. Just along here. Are you sure? We came through here before and there's no way back to talk. See? Is that so? Let me show you something.
Are you watching? Leosta! What? It's solid. Elven architecture. My bowstring was soaked in the light of Alfheim. It can now reawaken the magic of the elves. Wait, it won't just disappear, will it? Not as long as the light shines free. This way. I want one. Those roots. What kind of magic is that? It's Vanir. From Vanaheim? You know of it? Just stories. Mother didn't say much about the Vanir gods. Just that they're always at war with the Aesir. As compared to Odin and Thor, they're the good guys. There are no good gods, boy. Thought I taught you that. Alright, I guess I gotta open... I don't know how you got through here if you didn't open any of these freaking doors, huh? Tyr's temple. Built with help from the giants, Great Tyr used it to travel the Nine Realms and keep the peace between them. Doesn't seem very peaceful. Everywhere we go, we're attacked. Especially by dead things. The risen dead grow ever more numerous. Once the roads and trails would have been full of people. Now all have hid or fled, save for the Reavers. Savage enough to survive in such a world. <laughs> Big. Look how big that world serpent is, dude. That is retardedly huge. Look at that thing. Oh my god. Make a ride at the bottom of these stairs. What? What? Hey, another one of those light crystals. Wait there while I reawaken the light. Leosta. That did it. What are we doing exactly? Mending the disrepair. Start by lifting that axle. Good. Now push it back into place. Now realign the wheel onto the track. Perfect. Now push the bridge along the track. What? The Whoa. whole entire bridge is turning. How is the whole entire bridge turning? Boy, you're really strong. Just keep pushing until the bridge reaches its first position. Tired yet? No. He's always been really strong. So about the dead, we heard someone call him Hellwalk. But what are they? They are poor, restless souls, denied their judgment and their peace. By what? Did Vanir magic raise the dead? It could, once. But this, this is, is so no cool. spell. This plague of dead is but a symptom of a world out of balance. Something or someone has meddled with powerful forces. That is all I know for sure. That's perfect. Come back up. We're ready now. That was impressive. You didn't hurt your back, did you? I did not hurt my back. <laughs> I did not hurt my Through back. Through these doors. Wait. So did the giants or the elves build tier stuff? All the races helped with its construction. It was the last great act of cooperation between the realms before peace disappeared for good. Oh, where's Brack? Leosa. Your bowstring stopped glowing. Its power is now depleted. Only a few knocks of magic remained in the bowstring, and we used them. Your bow, please. Once you claim the light of Alfheim, infuse the bowstring with its power. Don't forget. Ah, yeah. You talk like you're not coming with us. I'll try, but measures were taken to keep me trapped in Midgard. Why? 
the gods don't care for me much. Is it? It's so dark. The this temple has been asleep, underwater for almost 150 winters. It needs only the light of the Bifrost to reawaken. Realm travel room. Woo, baby! Aw, shit. Those roots don't look like your magic. They aren't. These roots are part of the Great World Tree, and make travel between the realms possible. Here we go! How does it work? You will need this, a Bifrost, to create travel between realms. It can capture, hold, and transfer the Light of Alfheim. Place the Bifrost there. What now? Give it a moment. The temple needs time to wake up from its long slumber. It is from this room, and this room alone, that you will be able to cross between realms. What you see before you represents the temple in which we stand, as well as the realm towers that encircle the Lake of Nine outside. All the realms exist in the same physical space, reflections of each other. These doors, the towers outside, and the Nine Realms are all intertwined and coexisting on the branches of the World Tree, separated only by the Bifrost Light of Alfheim. This place can focus and control that light. And is this the World Tree? Only an artistic representation of it. No, the Yggdrasil is much, much more than this. The Tree of Life is bound to the fate of the world just as we are bound to it. The tree nourishes our soils. The dew from its leaves feeds our valleys and rivers. The tree's very existence supports oh, all of creation along its boughs. It's life energy interwoven into the tapestry of life. Birth, growth, death, and rebirth. Every strand transcending time, transcending space. Everything comes back to the tree. So, that's how it works. But I'm guessing you were looking for a more practical answer. Yes. Very well. The bridge you pushed outside is currently positioned to lead to the realm of Vanaheim. Instead, turn the wheel to our actual destination, Alfheim. Wait, is this moving the big bridge outside? Yes. The wheel turns the bridge, and the bridge aligns to the different realm towers on the lake outside. Wait, there's no tower on this one. And that's why realm travel to Jotunheim is impossible. Without a tower for the bridge to lock into, the sequence can't begin. Every realm has a travel rune that unlocks the bridge to that realm. I'm giving you the one for Alfheim. Now you can lock in your destination. This is so weird. <laughs> uh, okay, what are we doing? We're ready. Remember to take the Bifrost. You don't want to lose that. Now the realm travel bridge will align, and the realm between realms will open. Dang. See that giant crystal? Each realm has a corresponding one that focuses and amplifies the power of the Bifrost opening the bridge to that realm. That's why realm travel is only possible from this room. What about that one realm tower missing from the lake? The Jotunheim Tower disappeared from all realms over a hundred winters ago, when the giants vanished from Midgard. Where the tower went and how they moved it remain a mystery. Follow me. The Bifrost is dark. This trip was its last use. There's no going back until it's replenished with the light of Alfheim. So we are trapped. Someone of your ability should have little trouble getting back to Midgard. And we'll be able to make that black bread go away? With the captured light of Alfheim, yes. Alrighty. Let's do it! Alfheim, baby! Welcome to Alfheim! We made it!
Dun, 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 dun. The moment of truth, here we go! Woo! Dang! How time! Look at how beautiful it is! It's amazing! Dude, this looks so good! Welcome to Alfheim, gentlemen. Well, thank you. Think you can spot... The light. I can barely see it. Something's wrong. See that column of light on the horizon? It's housed in the heart of a ring temple. We'll find what we need there. No. No, no, no. Damn it, not yet. What's happening? <laughs> to restore the Bifrost magic, you must step into the light. But be very careful not to get it off. No! Huh. Hmm. What the hell? She's not dead. Is she? Not likely. Come. So that's our curse. She can't, like, leave. Look at this place. Stay by me. Touch nothing. Alrighty. Welcome to Alfheim, ladies and gentlemen. We've made it that far. Um, it's not, I guess it's not really that far in the game, but... I think you killed it. Look up there! Whoa, what's Whoa. that about? Not our concern, boy. Focus. Look at all these elves. Can you read that? Boy. What does it say? Hmm. Something about an eternal war for the light. I don't get it. If both sides need it, why not just share it? Greed. You will find it a common cause for war. We got the chest. Sha na 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 na. Okay. Uh oh. They keep murdering the light elves. It is war. The end of one. The roped one's lost. Oh. Attacking us? They didn't do anything. More will come. Okay. Hey, here we go. Ooh, Did is you this say something? No. Oh, okay. This is the last uh decryptor. Symbol of courage. Oh. Never mind. At least we're getting closer to the light. Wait, is that Sindri? Oh yeah, look at it. Look who it is. So, what can I do for you two? Um, nothing special there. New Master of Trades. How may I serve? Uh, okay. Was there more to discuss? Oh, wait. Yeah, let's, let's sell some. It. We gotta sell some stuff. I said there's an upgrade that you can do to the. Where were you even carrying those? Good. 
good. Also, remember to breathe. The secret to any craft is in the fine details. Well, scrounge around a bit more and we'll build something then. All right. Look, there's a boat tangled up over there. Yeah, hold on. I'm trying to upgrade my stuff, son. <laughs> there we go. The boat is free. What'd you say? I said nothing. Really? Okay. Oh god, the kid's hearing voices. He already said that once, I heard that earlier. Did your mother speak of this realm? Not much. Just that since the elves are always fighting over the light, we kept them isolated. Drink from the dew of the world tree brings lasting benefits. I just want to circle around and see what I can find here. It's pretty hard to see in this realm. Alright, I guess we'll just continue. Let's uh, do it! Um, so. Huh? Again, I said nothing. Yeah. This one you said so. What is it, boy? Oh, what's going on? Voices. You don't hear that? I hear nothing. It's going away now. It was screaming. Lots of voices. Angry. You really didn't hear that? No. It felt evil. Try talking to them? No. But maybe they need help. They do not stop us, so they do not concern us. But they maybe... do not concern us. Alrighty. This is some cool looking elves, huh? Alright. A lot of uh, rowing in the boat in this series, let me tell you. This is where the game kind of slows down for me. I think they do this to make the world feel better, but... That must be the Ring Temple. Lake of Light. Oh, now there's a Lake of Light. <laughs> I give up. There's too many lights and lakes and... Look, Lincoln they have lights. symbols in Alfheim, too. Should I read it? What does it ask? Without me or within me, death is sure. Yet within you, I am life most pure. But 
I don't see any runes around here. Oh, we must find it. Back to the boat. Back to the boat. Let's go swim around some more. Alright. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, so we gotta find some runes. I feel like the water has to lower or something. There's like stuff under here. It's sad the elves can't work things out. I don't find such a beautiful place, but war makes it ugly. You see with the eyes of a child. In war, a soldier sees beauty only in the blood of his enemy. The rest of him is lost. Sometimes never to return. You know about war, don't you? Wars are fought for two things, survival or advantage. Battles may be won by the better soldier. Wars are won by those who are willing to sacrifice everything to ensure victory. Okay. Focus up! What are you doing, kid? Heh. Easy peasy, baby. These puzzles are even hard, son. Oh, 303, if my health increased. Let's go, baby. Ooh. Wow, man. What are we looking at? Whoa. Did this just get dark in here? What are we supposed to be looking at? Atreus. Follow me. Be right there. Not sure what I'm supposed to do here. I feel like I gotta get up there somehow, but I don't even know how to do that.
Nah, sure. Alright, let's leave. See, some of these places I just waste my time because. Can't even do half of them. We in Elfheim scattering around. I guess we'll just go straight to the center. I don't know what else we need. I don't know what else we need to do. Sindri said mother was a warrior. Was she in a war too? Of a sort. Her family was decimated by hostile rivals, and she alone survived. She walked the warrior's path, but her war was to live on. To brave an unforgiving world alone. The blue door! That's gotta be the entrance. Let's go! Careful, boy. What are they doing? Oh! No! He just did covered the crystal with that stuff. Why? To prevent reinforcements. Uh oh. Got the elves. Threat now, boy. We got him. Okay. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. What's down there? Something, something down there. Maybe we can fix the bridge from down there? Yeah, we need this wheel. With a lot of wheels. Okay, so that did something. I think. Focus up. What? Oh god, another one. like that they kind of look like a room it doesn't make sense come back to the sand bowl to the sand bowl sandy cheeks is bowl we need to find a way into the temple to go to the sand bowl all right here we go there's another beach or something over there we can go to but eh, we won't worry about it we're really focusing on the story this time around so Brock and Sindri made Mom the axe just to help her survive? She had the strength to wield such a weapon, and the wisdom to use it for good. Enough. Stories are for the boat. We must focus. Father! The pillars and ring form an elvish room! Draw it. Yes, son. Uh -oh. Boy! It was the voices again, but different voices, less angry. They were asking for help. We are here for the light. I do not care who they are, nor what they want. You never care about anything. You have something to say? No. Uber. What's happening? Whoa. Whoa. Look what we found! Father? Yes? 
the voices I heard. It was hard to make out, but way in the back I'm pretty sure I heard. Mother. That is not possible. I know what I heard. Atreus, enough. It looks different. Look at those horns. Behind me, boy. That can't be good. Worth it. Hmm. See nothing in here. This is cool. Then you come out here and you press triangle. And watch this, guys. You ready? This is pretty epic. Ah, oh, damn it. Big sexy. Can't you see I am playing God of War? There it is. That puzzle. Puzzle puzzle. Uh, let's see, what's on this other side here? Alright, looks like a bunch of enemies, which I guess I'm up for. Let's do this. Let's dominate. Oh, what the hell? Oh, it's all broke. I guess this ain't gonna happen. Um, you know what guys, uh, we made it pretty far in this episode. We started from the mountain base, made it all the way to all time. And, uh, yeah, that's about it for this episode. Guys, if you enjoyed, make sure you hit that like button. YouTube loves those active subscribers, and that way they notify you better when you hit that subscribe button and that bell notification. Um, because they always send notifications to people who are active as shit. So, if you guys did enjoy... Well, stick around, hopefully, and uh, I guess we'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye!